Whoa, what's good with the YouTube and YouTube bus? Triple Cup Chuck, and I'm up. Yes, it's a beautiful day. Hey, Spider Man and Doctor Strange lawsuit, right? Will this affect a movie coming out? Just to let y'all know, this is opinion based. <laughs> yes, I'm out here in a beautiful day. Mm. Okay, now back to what we were saying Spider Man and Doctor Strange. They having a lawsuit that's going on about the rights to this and stuff like that. And um, I was hearing a lot of people asking me like, hey, Triple Cup Chuck, man, what you think about is the Spider-Man and Doctor Strange movie release date going to get affected? Is this going to affect the movies going forward? Is it going to affect this? I say yes and no. A lot of people just don't know. Even, even if you do know, this type of thing happens all the time. It just don't get in the spotlight. But because of Scarlett Johansson and the shit show that they got going on and then with the Russo brothers, yeah, all of that is bringing more topics like this straight to the light right so why this bringing topics to the light that make people that want to um reach and grab like you know the lawyers they be what people call oh, the devil lawyers and how they go for anything and everything this is the perfect opportunity to to attack to me they like hyenas like you ever seen on the lion king when the hyena wait for something weak or something the strong animal is at a vulnerable position before they attack because they're not uh, strong enough to attack head on that's why i think what this situation going in going on is but um yeah, it was called a Johansson. She got, uh, you know, I can understand because if it's from what my perspective, from what I'm hearing is this whole streaming thing with releasing on Disney Plus, the whole factor is, okay, if y'all selling it, like, let's say, I would look at it as a movie ticket. So everybody that purchased this for this amount is like two people purchasing a movie ticket, right? Because you're still having a $30 price point. So if a $30 price point, that's the price of two movie tickets. I consider every every purchase of that movie will be just like a movie sale. And they'll squash all that. They're just for my personal opinion. But anyway, why me? Because, you know, that be if I can't go to the movies, that is the movies. But that's my personal opinion about that. But the can of worms that it opened up was a person that's uh generation down nephew cousin wh whoever he is i didn't want to take the time to address who he actually is but just the whole fact of his uh parents grandparents or uh, uncle whatever hey um had a hand in doing the um the art for spider-man and dr strange that he feel like he's entitled to some of the money after even uh he said he wasn't you know she didn't want nothing for these characters because he, from what he did, he got what he wanted, and that should have been a done deal. But now that since all these lawsuits going on and everything that people are talking about, about with uh, with Spider Man and Doctor Strange and Sony is already is uh, one blow away from um, not existing no more, and you have a corporation like Disney already in a huge shit show of a um, of of a lawyer suit between that and Scarlett Johansson about how they're getting treated and the Russo brothers and all these things going on. It's just not one punch. It's like, you know, getting hit with a thousand knives, right? That's the, um, the part of the situation that I think that people is overlooking that it might not just be from this scenario because this happened all the time. This is nothing new. Disney have a team of lawyers. Shit, uh, Marvel have a team of lawyers. Sony still have a team of lawyers so they could be able to resolve this incident behind closed doors. But if they by them bringing it to the light, will this affect the um, movie industry going forward? Yes. And bad, it might take uh, a lot of our triple or uh, quadruple a blockbuster movies might uh might no longer exist no more and they're gonna have to be more scaled down movies just because they don't want to take such a, such a big risk so a movie like uh black widow that's gonna be the future going forward of budgets but maybe if shang chi keep doing good like uh like what i was predicted to be so shang chi shang chi you know i'm country y'all gotta take it how it is well we can run some more about this here and i got my avengers yeah i'm still i'm a captain america person avenger i'm gonna talk about uh how to resurrect that uh, marvel avengers game well this is your boy triple coach chugging and appreciate y'all for rocking with me i'm out yeah <laughs>